Hello and welcome to Goma at Home. Today we're preparing bachoy. Wow! Sabi to. Tapos medyo umuulan ng konti, no? Tapos meron kang mainit na bachoy soup. So today, and dito yung mga ingredients natin. We have liempo, atay, kidney of the pig, and then we'll make this into a very rich, very hot soup. Okay? So first, lalagyan natin yung itong uh, liempo sa boiling water. Okay? And this will be the base of our soup. And then later on, dadagdag natin dito, pakukuluan natin pala, lambutin, uh, lulutuin din natin initially sa boiling water yung ibang ingredients like uh, yung atay and then yung uh, kidney. Okay? We'll put this there. And then, to make the soup base really rich, Lagyan natin siya ng dried shrimps. Hmm, itong hibi. Para dumagdag lang yun, ano yung richness ng soup. So, there it is. Nasa maluto, lumabot itong uh, pork natin. Let's wash my hands. Okay. okay. Simulan natin, gagawin natin yung base natin for the soup. Of course, we have luya. Then we have garlic and onions. Alam nyo, itong, itong batsoy na to. Nagsimula to sa, sa Iloilo in uh, 19... 38, ang gumawa nito si Federico Killergan, no? Na siya yung pinaka-famous na nag-invent itong uh, Lapas Batsoy. Pero, you know, sa haba ng panahon, ang dami ng versions na lumabas. May Batsoy Tagalog, may Batsoy Iloilo, iba-ibang klaseng Batsoy. So, it really depends on, again, on the kind of uh, ingredients that you you have na available sa, in sa inyong lugar, no? Una, ang tawag nga na dito sa Iloilo, sabi nila, tala is bats, no? And then, dinagdag dala yung choy. So, siguro yung, yung choy dahil sa baka boksoy, dahil mayroong mga mga gulay-gulay, di ba? And then, another one naman, sabi nila, galing yan sa Chinese community, sa Lapas, kasi tawag daw nila dati dito sa, ano, sa soup na to, baki. Ito yung baki, mga, ito na soup din na may shredded meat. So, sa haba ng panahon, dami ng version. So, okay. This now, we just call it bachoy. So, I'll just cut our onion. There you go. Okay. Okay, and then garlic. Yun. Hmm, bango. I can smell yun, no? Babskit, saka yung hibi. Kumukulo na siya. It's going to be good. Sa so, dami kasi ng ingredients niya. Mahaba yung preparation para sa ingredients para to make the soup. So, ay kailangan, marunong ka rin mag-manage ng time mo when you cook bachoy. So, you can prepare the dish and at the same time, boiling other ingredients para lumambot na yung baboy. And then, mayroon pa tayong other ingredients like itong kidney and liver, no? Tapos, ang sarap yun to, lagyan natin ng blood na, ano, ng baboy. Para iba-iba yung flavor, iba-iba yung texture. It makes for a very rich bachoy soup. So, I'm getting ready with my garlic na mamaya isusote na natin to. I'll uh, pre-boil na rin yung, uh, natin, yung kidney. Because yung kidney, mas maganda to na maayos yung pagkaluto. Otherwise, pag hindi mo siya niluto na mabuti, medyo may ano siya, medyo mapanghi yung, yung smell niya. Because nga, kidney. Okay, let me just close this. Yun. So, yung mga ingredients natin nandito na. What I'll do next is to move this dun sa kabila para we can uh, start cooking our bachoy. Lipat natin to. Dito. Yun. And then, we'll prepare our pot for the soup. We'll heat it up. And then, lalagyan natin siya ng oil. And then, pag mainit na, we'll put in our aromatics. Garlic. Our onions, our luya. Masarap talaga ito pag maraming luya. Actually, yung base ng tinola, ganito rin. Luya, onions, garlic. So, sa batsoy, basically ganun. Nagkakaiba lang pagdating sa soup. Okay? So, we'll put in our aromatics. We'll put in first our uh, onions. And then, sabay na natin yung uh, luya natin. We'll put in lots. Wow. Labas na labas yung flavor niya mamaya. Okay? And then, just uh, mix it. Beauty. Nice. Let's just cook our onion. Pag medyo translucent na yung onions natin, then I'll put in the garlic. That should be good. So next, let me get my garlic. Okay. Let's mix it. Mmm. Ito pa lang, yun. Wow. Ito pa lang, solve ka na eh. Sarap, bo. Oh. And then at this point, medyo luto na itong uh, pork natin. Kunin ko na siya. Nice. You go. Iwanan muna natin yun natin dito. Yung uh, kidney boiling. Oh, yun lang siya. Let it boil. So, abang ginagawa natin itong uh, aromatics natin dito, we'll start cutting down our pork. So, mainit yung pork. Ingat lang. Ayan. There you go. 
kailangan dito, very sharp talaga yung knife mo. Pag may mga buto na ganun, you can take them out if you don't want to include them. Okay. There. Saluhin natin to. By the time na maluto na to, ibabagsak na natin yung pork natin. Take it the hibi. Yung hibi, ginamit na natin talaga yung pang-flavor lang ng broth natin. So ito na, naputulo natin yung pork natin. Lalagay natin siya dun sa ginigisa natin kanina. Okay. Drop it there. Ganun lang. Alright. Nice. Lakasan natin niya, boy. The pork is cooking here. Nice. Beauty. Punta ko na yung kidney. Ganda. Okay. So while the pork is cooking, i-add na natin yung ibang meat pa natin dito. Hindi ko lang isasama yung shrimp natin. Next, lalagay ko na yung atay natin. No? So I used about a kilo of uh, about a kilo of pork, half a kilo of the kidney, and uh, half a kilo of the liver. Yun. Ganda. Ganda. Good. Ngayon, maganda na yung ano niya. Yung pagkasute niya. Mas mag-brown ng konti yung yung liver natin. I'm going to add in our broth. Okay. So we can put in some salt. Remember, hindi ako naglagay ng salt sa broth natin. Hindi ako naglagay ng salt ngayon pa lang. So you can put in a lot of salt. Let's put in some pepper. Good. Beauty. Then mix natin siya. After this, lalagyan siya ng broth. Yung broth natin, gusto natin pinakulo yung, yung baboy natin at yung kidney. Yun naman ilalagyan natin dito. Mm-hmm. Ganda, kumukulo na siya. Bang mo, I can really smell it. Ang sarap. Tapos mamaya, lalagyan siya ng spring onions. Dito natin lalagyan natin ng konting sugar. Just to balance things. Yung saltiness. Okay. Should be good. And then, now we let it boil. Aloy ko muna. Oh, ganda. I'll just add our blood. Kinuha kong blood. Pig's blood. Pero kinuha ko yung bona. So, ito na ilalagyan natin doon. I love this. Nung bata ako. Yung dugo ng baboy. Nasa sabaw. Oh, sarap. There. Okay. We'll just put it in. Sama natin dito. With this, magdadagdag siya ng color. Okay. One more mix. And then we'll let it boil. Ah, pakaganda. Let me cover this. And then, while it's cooking, Linisin ko na ulit yung table ko. So, we'll clean this with the hydrogen peroxide. Yung mga bubbles na nakikita mo dito, yun yung mga nag-build up na bacteria coming from mga raw ingredients natin. No? So, dyan natin pinutol kanina. Kaya, may, may build up ng bacteria. Ganun talaga pag, pag raw food. So, this one. Ganun lang. And then, kuha ko ito yung na paper. Ito yung ang uh, chopping board. There you go. Everything's clean, and we can start working again on our chopping board. There you go. Okay, let's check on our soup. Oh, ganda ng kulo. Inana natin yung fire natin. Nice. So everything's cooked. Pinapasimmer na lang natin. We can uh, try our soup now. Ang kumusta yung lasa niya. Oh! Dami. Put in a little sugar. Mix it again. Sipa. Mm. Good. Okay. We'll let it boil for another 10 minutes and then we'll serve it. I'll just prepare yung, yung green onions natin. There you go. So, gawin ko. Yung white onion, yung white part, sasama ko siya dun sa soup. Yeah, there you go. And then yung, yung green part, the leaves, yun ang gagamitin ko for garnish. Okay. When you add ingredients, just mix it a little. Ayan. Para yung flavors mag-incorporate. Okay, let's close it again. Five more minutes and we're done. And then, handaan natin yung ating uh, chicharon para lalagyan natin ng garnish ng chicharon sa ibabaw. Let's try the chicharon kung masarap ba to. Mmm! This bean curd chicharon. So crispy bean curd. Kasi maraming tayong pork para huwag naman masyadong maraming kolesterol. Remember, pork plus yung mga 
mga innards, no? kidney, blood, atay. Pag sumobra yan, kain mo, tapos medyo meron kang gout. Sigurado bukas hindi ka makakalakad. Bawasan natin. Lagyan natin ng bean curd chicharon. Hmm! Ano na? Ito. Just hmm. cut it. Yan lang, ha? So this one will be used for our garnish. Yan lang. That's it. One last check. If we're good, we're done. Hmm. Yum, tapit na. Okay. Ay. Pag nagsishare ka ng uh, itlog, you can run it sa, ano, you can run it sa, sa water. Para yung tubig po mapasok sa eggshell, mas, mas madali siyang tanggalin. Ayan. Hmm? Mas malinis pa. See that? Okay. Ito yung mga pang toppings natin sa sa ating ano, batsoy. At this point, ito na lahat, ready to serve. Ilalagay natin yung final ingredient natin, which is the miswa. Bagsakan lang na siya ng miswa doon. Lagyan natin yung miswa natin dyan, and we're done. Yun, ganda talaga. Okay. Yung traditional na, ano, na, na batsoy, yung ginagamit naman nila dito, Mickey noodles. No? But you can use any kind of noodles. No? Yung egg, we'll uh, slice it in half. And then, one more mix para humalo yung miswa dun sa soup natin. At this point, we can turn off our fire. Yan na. Yan na siya. Ganda. So, the miswa is cooked already. So, one scoop of this goes into our bowl. Beautiful. Yan na soup. And then, hindi natin ang egg natin. Yun, sulit na sulit. Onions. There. And itong ating chicharon made out of bean curd skin. There. Okay. Konting garlic. Just, just like that. On top. Alright. I present to you our bachoy. Let's try this. First, kompleto na siya with the soup. And a little of uh, meat. Mmm. Wow. Ang complex na, no? Ang soup. Daming layers and flavor. Yung pork. Mmm. Sarap. Lagi niyo yung batsoy. Marami talaga klaseng batsoy. Marami yung versions ng batsoy. So it really depends on how you want to cook it, how you want to present it. But what is important is that you enjoy cooking and you enjoy the food that you serve to your family, to your friends, and to your loved ones. Okay? So thank you so much for <clears throat> joining me right here in Gomatom. I'll see you next time. Let's enjoy this batchoy. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and press on the notification bell para alam nyo pag meron tayong bagong video na lumalabas. Bye! See you again. Bye! One more. Mmm!